Alright guys, so I just got the Pete's Analog B pad today, uh, version 1.1 .1. and I'm also going to get the uh, Analog Shimmer pad today, later today. So definitely check this out, they are amazing. So I want to show you how to import and map the mod wheel to filter cutoff in EXS24. I just go to music, uh, audio music apps and sampler instrument. And this is where you're going to drop the uh, EXS24 file. And now go to logic or main stage. In this case, I'm using main stage. Uh, and load the EXS24 sampler stereo. And the first thing you need to do is refresh menu in case you don't see the sample over here. So refresh and then go back and it's going to be there. Pete's analog B pad 1.1 and this is how it sounds dry so version the first version I think the filter was off so it wasn't doing anything for a lot of people uh, were asking how to do this so just make sure uh, the cutoff is on and uh, the filter is on and uh, just to make sure nothing else is going on so we're gonna bypass all of these slots and just use one this one right here uh, pick the filter cut off uh, and down here pick the control one and just leave this all the way up like that and now roll this off Uh, I think I like it right there or what I'm I'm also I'm also playing really low in the keyboard because I want a lot I really love to get uh, a lot of bass if you go higher or higher so I'm playing really really low so I like to have it over here at like 9, 29% and, and so I'm controlling the filter cutoff with the mod wheel now Uh, now I want to try it with a reverb plugin. I have my favorite reverb plugin right now, the Valhalla Shimmer, and the preset. I'm just using a factory preset called uh, Concert Hell. So with that on. thing I wanted to point out is that I don't feel safe when the, my meter goes orange so I always try to lower the volume and turn uh, up my interface when I want more volume so I set my interface at 75% so take uh, let the sound guy take care of my volumes levels so uh, I'll go like Just about here, minus seven, minus six, seven or eight um, decibels. So I just feel safer that way. 
So that's how you map the mud wheel to filter cutoff, guys. And uh, hope that helps. And uh, that's all for now. See you in the next video. Bye.